Hello, my name is Rich Howard, owner of Architectural Builder Supply, and this video is to bring you a closer look at the AJW UX81-BF bright finish soap dish with a washcloth bar, recessed model. Okay, This is a handsome um, recessed soap dish in my opinion. It's handsome because the fit and finish on it is very good. It's all stainless steel. I mean, every part on this is stainless steel. And it's heavy. It's there's a slight amount of magnetism to the stainless, but that would be typical for you know a, a, a grade of stainless used for this. Um, handsome because of the finish, and it's also substantial. It weighs a pound and a third itself. It's really nice and, and, and heavy. Uh, it's slightly larger than a lot of the common uh, uh, units that you'll see, and for some people, this size is a perfect sort of example uh, for it. Um, there is a uh, link below this video to the product brochure, which shows you this and its sister uh, products um, in one consolidated document. And that document is nice to look at because you can view everything that AJW offers in this realm. And while that document has a couple of pages of uh, ancillary items not directly related, when you see the page, I think it might be page three, you'll be able to review this and how it uh, compares against the other available items. Now, back to this item. There's a link below this video to what's called the tech sheet. And the tech sheet uh, shows everything important uh, about it in a consolidated fashion. First of all, the installation of this item is intended to be mortared into the wall. And these two welded uh, lugs, not lugs, but anchors are really what they are. Uh, you're intended to insert this into a wet mortar filled wall. Uh, I've installed these. You're going to want to brace this after you get it in in place so it can't move. But those holes allow the mortar to come through and to hold it in securely. Um, so getting it in place is the idea uh, for it to uh, set up uh, is the only thing that you have to do beyond that. But that's how the installation of this aspect goes. You can also get this model with a clamp if you've got a drywall uh, application where you can fish a U-shaped clamp into the wall and then this attaches directly to the clamp and as you tighten it the clamp compresses down over the wall because you're drawing it in with the screws. Now dimensionally you can see from the uh, tech sheet that it is seven and an eighth inches wide, five, a five inch tall or high and that is the case as well and has a depth They've got a depth of two and three quarter. Yeah, that would be correct. Now, what you're going to see there, uh, the next important thing is the rough opening. And they've got five and five eighths, three and three quarter by three inch. Well, the three inch depth is correct because we just measured the uh, projection or the depth of the unit itself at two and three quarter. And they're going to want a quarter inch margin pretty much. So you'll be at, um, you know, provided that we're, you know, a about five and seven eighths. Oh, forgive me, five and three eighths, and that is indeed the case. And then about three and five eighths, or th um, pardon me, three and a half inch. That's th that also makes sense as well. Uh, dimpled uh, feature to the bottom where the soap rests, and that's to allow obviously uh, airflow underneath, so the soap doesn't get stuck down at the bottom. So the specification, which is important to review. Uh, fabricated of one piece stamped construction. So this is all one piece of material except for the washcloth which is welded on afterwards. You can see evidence of that. And then these the, anchor, the mortar lugs. Uh, bright finish done around. S uh, standard soap dish, uh, outer flange, beveled edge. You can see that that's the case. It has a beveled edge. Okay. S concealed side mounting clamps are provided for mortar. So that, that's what the reference there is. Internal, internal part of shell where the soap rests has stamped dimples to allow airflow. Uh, makes sense. The SF version of this, if you uh, trade or, or substitute the BF for SF, that would give you a satin stainless steel finish. And then the installation is on the uh, right hand side. Coordinate wall opening at desired specification, pardon me, at this uh, specified location uh, with a building professional uh, to avoid any sort of conflict with material on the wall. 
conceal, place concealed mounting clap dish and wall opening. It has tightened fasteners to clamp. That's for your drywall installation, not for a mortar installation like this. The only other dimension we've really not checked is the projection of the washcloth bar. We've got it at inch and a quarter. Let's take a look. Yeah, that's right on as well. Like I said, a really nice quality item. Um, okay. AJW is a full line manufacturer of all things commercial bathroom related. Not only typical recessed soap dishes that you're going to see in residential construction, remodeling construction uh, in residential applications, motels, hotels, but they of course get into all of the you know, very high use, high volume material that you'll see in airports, movie theaters, hospitals, you know, grab bars, mirrors, combination units, towel dispensers, etc. If you have any questions on the AJW UX81BF recessed soap dish in a bright stainless finish or any other AJW product, please feel free to reach out to us. Thank you.